Coaching Show with your host, Master Certified Coach Christopher McCollum. Thank you, Dick Warren. Having a little trouble hearing myself today. Uh, did you ever have a day like that? Okay, uh, welcome. Today, this is the level of energy that's required for today's show. Just, just to keep up, you're going to need this much energy. It's true. First of all, we should note what's happening in the world. Today is November 6th, uh, the day after Election Day for some of the states in the United States. And, you know, allow me to join the pundits doing their <coughs> Wednesday morning quarterbacking. Uh, I think we're all very excited, not only about uh, whatever else happened, but I think we're mostly excited. I think you all join me in being excited that there's a McAuliffe in the governor's mansion. I don't know much about the guy or his politics. Here's what I know. I like the name. That's what I say. Okay. Um, we should, in all seriousness, though, we should talk about, hold on, hold on. That's right. We should talk about. The value of membership in the International Coach Federation. Why? Because we, my friends, yes, you are listening to an official ICF media partner. So go online, check out coachfederation.org and build credibility, connect to the coaching community, cultivate your professional growth, and stay up to date on our industry trends. You can do all that with the amount of amazing resources available at coachfederation.org. And while you're at it, Go check out your local ICF chapter. If there's one thing that our guest today will talk about, it's the value of the International Coach Federation and your participation in it. So get there today, ICF, International Coach Federation, building our profession. Uh, shout out to, uh, go check out boxofcrayons.com. The More Good Work MBA program is starting this week. Check it out, boxofcrayons.com. Calm, I want to say, and I think in saying that, I'll be wrong. I'll check it out at the break. <sighs> Let's all take a breath. That was a lot of plugs, a lot going on. All right. Uh, in the spirit of great work, we've got two extraordinary coaches with us today. I'm delighted to welcome, I believe for her first time here, a uh, master certified coach, somebody that's truly a pioneer and a, and a leader in the coaching world. Paulette Rao is a master certified coach. She's a leadership coach for Corn Ferry. She's a former coach and trainer for Results Coaching Systems, Ken Blanchard Companies. She's certified by New York University as an executive and organizational coach and is an adjunct professor in the executive coaching certificate program there. She is uh, also the executive vice president of the New York City ICF board. That's right, Manhattan, folks, and the principal of True North Resources. Uh, Paulette is a leadership and mentor coach, a trainer, a marketing expert, and she helps leaders enhance their performance and the performance of their team while achieving organizational objectives. Welcome, Paulette. Thank you. What a lovely and energetic introduction. I appreciate it. <laughs> well, thanks. And I was going for either, so getting both was great. Yes. Now, <laughs> Uh, you heard the, you heard me shout out for the ICF, and I know that, um, it's not the main thrust of our conversation today, but let's talk for a moment mm -hmm. about New York City ICF. What's happening in the, in the Big Apple? Mm. Well, we have some good news. Um, those of us on the ICF New York City board are very energized and committed to making sure that our constituents get everything they need to, everything from theory, practice, skills, and information about how to grow their practice. And as such, over the past few years, and in particular this year, we've been really focusing on how to get them exactly what they need from the best cutting-edge educators out there at a cost-effective price and get their continuing education class and do it to do it at member meetings and have easy, convenient classes and as a result of all this work that we've been doing, our membership has grown this year to about 500 members. We've had an increase in about 120 members in the past year alone. That's extraordinary. So yeah. we're, yeah, we're really hopping. We're really excited and energized and doing a lot, and people are responding. The coaches are saying, yes, this is what I need and want, and I'm willing to come back if you're providing that. Great. So really proving that sometimes your best resource is your coaching colleague who's either slightly before you or at the same level. Um, are there resources there for coaches who are 
a little further along? I mean, I know that New York has certainly mm-hmm. been a, a pioneer area for coaches. Is there? Are you yeah. being able to pull back some of the MCCs like you and me? Yeah. Well, that's been a target and a goal for us to get back the MCCs and the PCCs in the marketplace who felt that perhaps the International Coach Federation chapter couldn't provide them with what they needed. And I think our mission in the past year has been to prove that wrong and to really take a look at the quality of our content and how we deliver it. And as a result, we've, we've reeled a few back in. Nice. So I do think that we're changing course with that. I think, it, you know, it's like with any market, Christopher. You have to understand what they need and then deliver it. And I think that, you know, being a volunteer board, I think we did our best. But I don't think we always met the mark. And I think we're really focused now on understanding um, what the needs are and assuaging the pain and providing it to them in the best way possible. Great. And so anyone within the sound of our voice in the, uh, you know, among the 8 million people in New York City, where should they <laughs> where should they go for more information? Oh, please go to the ICF New York City website. It's icfnyc.org. Dad. icfnyc.org. I like that. And it. if for some reason you have trouble with that, you can reach me, Paulette, at truenorthresources.com. I can always get you pointed in the right direction. Beautiful. Thanks. And now uh, what's your what's your job over there? Do they do they just have you sweep mm. up or what happens there? Yeah. <laughs> the first two years I was in charge of snacks and I was very <laughs> happy to do that job. <laughs> I'm very good at picking out snacks. And um, <laughs> lately I've been um, two years ago I was the vice president. This year I was the executive vice president and I just got the good word last week that I'll be the president next year of the chapter. Whoop, whoop, the president. That's right, people. Yeah, I'm excited. I'm excited. I just, you know, I love to give, Christopher, especially when I care. And it's it's just a a beautiful opportunity. I'm, I'm really excited about it. It's extraordinary. Thank you so much for stepping up there. The president of New York City's charter chapter of the ICF. We're so excited. Next time, I'll make sure we have Hail to the Chief ready for uh, for you when you show up. Thank you so much for being with us and for that uh, information and, and learning about New York City coaching. Now... You are a woman with extraordinary uh, experience. You've got 28 years of experience as a senior executive and sales and marketing leader in corporate America. Uh You've also got quite Uh a a CV in the world of coaching. As I said, a master Uh certified coach. You know, you're a founding Uh fellow of the Harvard Institute of Coaching Professional Association. Among Uh among all the, uh, there really too many to mention here, but a lot of extraordinary awards and designations. Thank you. But what I'm excited to talk about is the work that you've been doing and involved with in coaching and the brain, the neuroscience Mm. field of coaching. Tell us, uh, Mm. especially people who may not know what we're talking about, give us a lead into that. Sure, sure. Well, very simply, in the past 20 years especially, a lot of the findings, a lot of the neuroscientific findings that are emerging are explaining a lot about how coaching works and why it works so well. And as a result, we as coaches now can understand from a physiological perspective why someone needs to come to their own answers to learn more quickly and to retain more deeply, why we need to focus on solutions rather than dwelling on problems, you know, why learning needs to be dosed out over time in a coaching engagement, why positive emotions are really necessary in a coaching engagement in order to retain and learn and how setting goals helps us attain what it is that we're after. So when we study the brain, we really see why the things that we do as a coach, for example, acknowledge, are really important and actually help facilitate what it is that we're looking to achieve. So neuroscience is explaining why coaching works, simply put. It seems uh, somewhere between science fiction and something I should have studied uh, instead of being an English major. So, <laughs> what, give us a give us a little bit, especially us non science 
pe- science people an idea about the about hmm. the kind of research that's been done. Okay. Well, there are you know there are so many people that have been researching the brain. As you mentioned, and we have Joseph Ladiga, who's done phenomenal work. We have John Rady, and oh gosh, so many others. But essentially, if you if you look at all the data, and David Locke, one of my um, first teachers mm-hmm. and one of my mentors, has been really great at putting together a, a synopsis of all of it. And basically, he calls it the six insights about the brain, and that's really just an easy way to think about it. Um, basically, it's understanding how we create new thinking. And if we understand how new thinking is created in the brain, well, then we as a coach can facilitate that happening with ease and speed. Your normal conversations, Christopher, can go, you know, they can be really circuitous. They can go into drama, details, problems, round and round. And often that's fun because if you look in our country at what's popular on TV or what's popular as a pastime, it's stuff that's very deep and dramatic. Mm-hmm. Everything from soap operas to so go puzzles. To Any, yeah, anything uh, with UV. Kardashian in it. You, you've made your point clear. Yes, right. <laughs> Drama details, problems, right? Mm-hmm. And those crime shows. Think of those, you know? So our brain loves that. And, and, and that's how we like to speak. You know, if, if you ask me to go out for a cocktail, you know, we'll, we'll dish, we'll talk, we'll, we'll get into all the juicy details. Oh, and that music tells me that I've mismanaged my time yet again. This is okay. this is an issue with my brain. So remember exactly where you are, which is that we love the juicy mm-hmm. dish. And when we come back with our juicy dish, Paulette Rao, we'll talk more about brain-based coaching and the extraordinary work that she's doing. You're listening to The Coaching Show. Stay with us. The acronym AVID, Advancement via Individual Determination, has reigned true for me. I learned how to advance through my own determination. And AVID has taught me lifelong lessons that I will never forget. AVID believes that I'm capable of achieving my goals and wants to help me as much as possible. And it feels good to know that I have people who believe in me and want to see me succeed. Do you want to be a professional coach? Are you in business trying to make a real difference with people you manage or work with? Have you started a coaching practice that isn't quite getting off the ground? Get the skills you need to be a successful coach today with the Coach's Training Program from Accomplishment Coaching. The Coach's Training Program will show you how to help others focus and be more fulfilled. Whether you want to improve your company's bottom line or create a thriving coaching practice, Accomplishment Coaching can give you the distinctions and practices you need to coach others effectively today. Accomplishment Coaching has spent six years developing a cutting-edge coaches training program that will have you ready to coach people professionally in just 12 months, and you don't have to take time off work to do it. To find out more about the Coaches Training Program, just call 1-888-548-6813. That's 1-888-548-6813. We see it every day. Courts overflowing with frivolous lawsuits. People losing all of their assets simply because they were unprepared. The best defense against unscrupulous predators and creditors is a good offense. At Corporate Direct, we use the latest legal tools to help our clients of all sizes and from all over the world create a strategy to protect what is theirs. Think asset protection is only for the wealthy? Think again. Our Cover Your Assets strategies and tools are very affordable and practical. Industry leader Corporate Direct is owned and operated by attorney and best-selling author Garrett Sutton. Give us a call at 1-800-600-1760 or go to CorporateDirect.com to see how we can tailor a CYA plan for you. That CYA, cover your assets with Corporate Direct. 1-800-600-1760. That's 1-800-600-1760 for CorporateDirect.com. Gotham Books presents Marriage Rules by Harriet Lerner. The book Martha Beck calls required reading for anyone hoping to interact successfully with any other human, not just for those in romantic relationships. Available wherever books are sold. 